Praise the Lord, my beloved people all over the world. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the Word of God, Garden and More. You are welcome, welcome, welcome. My subscribers, God bless you, God bless you, God bless you. And if you have not subscribed, subscribe. Huh? And press the bell and you'll be notified when a new video is here. Come on, you can learn one or two things. So today, I'm going to show you a plant. You know, it's called greens, you know. All the time I was growing up, it was green, green, green. Then, when I wanted to plant greens, I checked in eBay and I saw that the greens have different colors. They come with different colors. And the name of this plant is called Amaras. That is the botanical name. A-M-A-R-A-N-T-H. Amaras. And, you know, it's packed full of nutrients. You know, it has a lot of health benefit. Like I always tell us, just Google. We are going to put the name in the in the box so that you'll be able to Google for yourself. But people from Nigeria knows uh, green, although this is a the, the the another color because I found out that it comes with other you know colors. So this uh, this uh, vegetable. You use it like every other vegetable you understand so don't be don't be scared of it you know but use it when it's tender you know i left it so you know we didn't cut it when it was tender you, you know when you plant it you don't wait for it to have these flowers before you cut it you know when you cut it it's, it's this big you, you cut it and use it to cook and the more you cut it the more it grows okay but when you want to plant if you want to save the seed then you can wait for it to grow so the, the flowers will come. This one, you are going to cut it and dry it and the seeds comes out and you prepare your soil and you sprinkle your soil and you uh, water, water them until they, they start growing. They grow very well, very easy to take off. So this is amaranth. This is green that we Nigerian call greens, but it comes with other different colors. And this is the deep uh, 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 maroon color. And like I said, it's full of nutrients health benefit it has a lot of health benefit so what we do is that you check you google the health benefit you find out that it's a pack full of you know nutrients vitamins it has so many uh health benefit it reduces a uh, 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 inflammation it helps with a with, with, uh, uh, weight loss it lowers a uh, uh, cholesterol it has so many, many, many uh, uh, things. It has a lot of vitamins. It's packed full. So I encourage you anytime you come across all this food, all these vegetables, read them, open, you know, check, you know, everything. It fights inflammation, like I said, and it reduces the risk of uh, developing uh, cancer. It helps to normalize uh, blood pressure level. It's a good source of protein. It has so many... You know, it has like lysinin uh, properties. It helps with digestion because there's fiber. So many, so many things. There, you know, it has a lot of minerals like calcium, magnesium, copper. You know, it's a good. It has a good source of uh, zinc, potassium, phosphorus. It helps you to. It they, they can help you to build up. Uh, you know, your bones, strong bones, muscles. It, it helps uh, hydration, boost energy, and so many, many. You know. Uh, 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 things you know that it can do for the body very many vitamins so just google you spend time you google then you know how you can use it this is food this is our food so no wonder god told us in the in this world that our food is our medicine we can see that all these things are packed full so i'm going to encourage us when we are cooking them don't cook them too much so that the nutrient will still be there you just after you finish whatever you want to do, put it the last, you know, the last uh, ingredient you're going to put in your, whatever you have cooked, if you stir fry it very, you know, lightly, with all the other things you are, you are putting in it, then you eat it. So maintain yourself. So this is uh, amaranth, we call it green. In Nigeria, we use it to cook soups. We use it to make stew. We use it to, to we can add it with other vegetables. You can just do it as stir fry. And uh, you know that's what it is. So I'm very happy to show you guys, uh, you know, amaranth that we call green from Nigeria. We uh, 
but we from Nigeria. So if you want to plant it, you know, like what I'm going to do now, I'm going to cut all this. I'm going to cut them. I'm going to cut them. Then I'm going to lay them, or I'm going to lay a, a, maybe a newspaper or, or a paper towel. I'm going to lay it on it and leave it to dry. So once it dry, all the, the seeds will come out. I think this one look like light uh, brown. The seeds will come out. So when you want to plant, you prepare your soil. You know, with your, your soil has to be fine, you know. Then you now sprinkle and it grows. So I'm just here to show you some of the, the plants that I have and, uh, and to tell you the health benefit that our food is our medicine. So, and I, I just encourage everyone let us eat right. Let's eat right. Let us exercise. You understand? And eat the food that God has given to us. You know, when you maintain yourself, you, you, you eat right, you take your herbs, you understand? You can maintain yourself. And even if you are sick, there are a lot of herbs you can use that God has given to us for healing. But make sure you talk to your doctors and make sure that, you know, they, 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 they advise on what to do. But when you eat right with all these vegetables that are food, then they are for healing. Because that's what the Bible made us to understand. Yes, in the Bible, in Revelation 22, verse 2, I'm paraphrasing, it told us that, uh, you know, the, 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 the tree in the middle of the street, the 12 leaves are for the healing of the nation. So I believe strongly in it, that our food is our medicine. And not only, you know, being healthy, that is not the only thing. Not only for us to live a long life, it's for us to know who Jesus Christ is. Because Jesus Christ died for the whole world. To, he, he died to save all of us. So if you have not received Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior, what are you waiting for? It's easy. All you have to do is to ask Jesus Christ to forgive you your sin, tell him to cleanse you, and tell him to be your Lord and Savior. That's it. And look for a Bible-believing church to worship. Just worship properly, not just going there in and out, worship, go to their Bible uh, uh, classes, their Bible study, go to a prayer meeting, try to, to know about our Lord Jesus Christ, try to read the word of God, meditate on the word of God, obey the word of God, and God will be with you. Because at the end, it's not all just living healthy life that matters. It's where are we going? Where are we going? So welcome once more to this, uh, the word of uh, God, uh, garden and more, where we, you know, uh, 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 teach people about what the word of God has to stay in every aspect of our lives. So I, 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 I thank you guys for watching. So I'm going to cut it. I've cut the flowers now, so I'm going to dry them so that I can plant them next time. Thank you guys for watching. God bless you. God bless you always. Shalom.